let's say there are two points, which is A and B. So point A, x1, x1 y1, and point B is x2, y2. So we want to find the distance between these two points. So let's say we construct a triangle triangle. Okay, so the distance, vertical distance, we have um, y1 and y2. So therefore, the distance of this line is y2 minus y1 to find the distance of that. So y2 minus y1. And then the horizontal line, which is x2 and x1. And the distance of that is, of course, y x2 minus x1. Now, if you think about it, remember Pythagoras' theorem. So you got this, a triangle triangle. The hypotenuse is C. We got A and B. So this means that C square is A square plus B square. And C equal square root of A square plus B square. There you go. So which means, let's say A is y2, um, y2 minus y1 and then um, B is x2 minus x1 and so on. So the distance of AB which will give me x1 minus x2 all square plus y2 minus y1 all square. It is Pythagorean theorem, that's all. So please keep that in mind. This is the rule to find out the distance of two points. Now, let's have a look at this one here. So we have a two point P and Q. So you know P is point P, I just write in here, which is minus one and one. And point Q is five and four. So X, X is five, Y is four. So five, four. Now, the distance is the distance formula PQ is equal to, let's say this is X1, Y1, this is X2 and Y2. So the rule is X2 minus X1 or square plus Y2 minus Y1 or square. Or square. And then you square root of that, of course. So to do this, I'm just using formula. So which is x2 is 5 minus x1 is minus 1. All square plus y2 minus y1. y2 is 4 minus y1, which is 1. All square. Square root of that. So which give me? So I put that in my calculator. So open bracket. 5 minus minus 1, I just want to show you, so you can you calculate as well, and then plus, open bracket, 4 minus 1, close bracket, or square. Just do that first, which is 45. So which is 45, square root of that. That is exact value. So if you want decimal point, so I just bring the calculator up first. So I got that 45 still there. I square root the answer. So which is 6.72, round to two decimal place. 6.71, sorry, round to two decimal place. So which is 6.71. So bring that up again. Because 6.708, so round to two decimal places. So 6.71, so which is units. That is the distance. Or you can do by um, using a Pythagorean theorem, of course, you can construct a triangle triangle. So let's say, for example, I just want to show you um, this one here. So you can do this way, very easy. You don't need to use formulas. So look. From 1 to 4 is 3 units. And from minus 1 to 5, so from here to here, 1 unit, another 5 unit, or together 6 units. So PQ, PQ square, you can write like this, equal Pythagorean theorem, of course, with the longer side, you add. So 6 square 
plus 3 square and then which is 6 square 36 plus 9 so which is 45 so therefore okay I can write PQ equals square root of that so which is if you put in this is um, put in um, if it's two decimal place you can put in calculator it gives you 6.71 units so this is how it works using Pythagorean theorem and to sort it out the other method the first method is just using formula just plug it in the um, the formulas and um, it gives you the answer now this one here so you have two points, which is 3, 2, and um, 7, 8. Find the distance of these two points. So all I would do is just do a using Pythagoras theorem, okay? So which is the distance of this. D stands for distance. So from 3 to 7 is 4 units. So which is 4 square. From 2 to 8 is 6 units. So plus 6 square so I square root of that of course so which is 4 square plus 6 square 4 square is 16 6 square is 36 so square root of that and then 36 plus 16 so is 54 uh, 52 so 52 because 6 plus 6 is 12 3 plus 4 is um, 3 plus 1 is 4, so 40 plus 5, um, another 10 is 52. So square root of that, so which is, if this is exact, okay, if they said answer in exact form, use this is exact. Sorry, exact. This is exact form. So if you want to live in um, exact form, you stop here, but if it decimal point, you just use calculator and you just uh, square root of 52 and then we give you the answer so 7.21 in um, two decimal places if you like okay so you can just write units if you like that's that's how you work it out again if you want a new formula so distance is equal to x2 minus x1 all square plus y2 minus y1 all square square root of that which is of course I clear this first so which is x1 y1 x2 y2 so which is 7 minus 3 all square plus 7 minus 2 I mean 8 minus 2 all square square root so if you type that in um, all you do is just type open bracket three uh, seven minus three all square and plus uh, a minus two all square give me fifty two and this square root. If the answer asks for exact form or insert form, you stop here. But at the moment, I just want two decimal place, so it still give you seven point two one. That's the answer. Now this one here. Find the distance of A and B. A, B, I mean. So find the distance of A, B, because I keep A, B, so I just write A, B, um, A, and um, B. So A, B is from minus 3 to 7, because from minus 3 to 0 is 3 units, and all the way to 7, another 7 units, so all together is 10 units, so which is 10 square. From 3 to A, so 3 to 8 is 5 units. So you add 5 square and square root of that. That's all. So 10 square is 100 and 5 square 25. Add them up, 125. Otherwise, just you calculate a 10 square plus 5 square equal 125. Square root of that. So if I want two decimal places, so just go square root of 125. So you should get... 11.18 uh, to two decimal places 11.18 okay units okay so two for two decimal places or again you formulas and just sort it out let's say a b is equal to remember x uh, x2 minus x1 all square plus y2 minus y1 
all square and square root of that so which is write it down first so this is x1 y1 this is x2 y2 so 8 minus I mean sorry 7 minus minus 3 because it's x2 is 7 minus x1 is minus minus 3 all square plus y2 is 8 and y1 is 3 so 8 minus 3 all square and square root of that so if you type that in your calculator I show you okay so you can just in case um, so you go just do inside um, the square root first so open bracket 7 minus minus 3 close bracket square plus open bracket 8 minus 3 close bracket square that give me 1 2 5 so the answer is 1 2 5 square root of that and then um, to do that um, two decimal places so 111.18 and then uh, units that's all okay so let's have a look at this one here um, last one so it's same thing so I just find a B I do a fast I'm not going to use formulas and um, you know how to use it very simple just apply the rule x1 y1 and x2 y2 and just apply formula so I'm going to do fast way just using Pythagorean theorem from 1 to 8 is 7 units from start from 1 you go all the way to 8 so which is 7 units so 7 square and then um, from 8 to 2 or from 2 to 8 same thing you talk about distance from 2 to 8 is 6 units so which is 6 square so square root of that so which is um, 7 square equal 49 otherwise I just use calculator I do all in one go so uh, which is I just go uh, 7 square which is 49 anyway plus 6 square 36 okay otherwise just equal 85 so the answer is 85 square root again if the uh, question asking for exact value or insert form you stop here that's the answer but again I want I want uh, two decimal places so you just go square root of 85 which is square root answer so which is uh, 9.2195 and so on but I want two decimal places I stop here because two number after decimal point but before I write 21 I look at this number 9 because it's greater than 5 you add 1 to this so 9.22 units so the distance of AB is 9.22 Thank you so much for watching my videos.